what's up guys KS Kiral here and this is the Poco FWIN and I finally managed installing the MIUI 11 running on this beast as you can see the new MIUI 11 so you can see the new settings application the bold font actually looks fantastic and without further ado so let's go into the my device and show you the MIUI 11 so as you can see it's actually the MIUI 11 9.9.9 .9 beta and there we go we're gonna go to the all specifications it says me 2s but not poco often why is like that because this is a GSI, right? So this GSI has extracted from the Mi Mix, so that's the reason. That's why it's showing this thing. And the Poco F1 is actually running this GSI pretty good. And I would like to tell you one thing. So the Poco F1 uh, is not gonna be get the Mi U11 currently, as of now by the time of recording this video, but it will gonna get the Mi U11 100% confirmed. And uh, currently, the Xiaomi is actually uh, updating the some of the devices uh, to the MIUI 11 beta so that's because of Xiaomi is only planning to release the MIUI 11 for the devices released in China and the Poco F1 is not the phone released in China it was released in India as well as some European countries that is the reason the MIUI 11 is not currently available for the Poco F1 but it will gonna get a MIUI 11 next month 100% sure so you don't need to worry about that by the time of recording this video, there is no zip file that you can directly flash onto your POCO of Win to get the full advantage of the POCO resources, unfortunately. And yeah, I tried managing installing this GSI. Just want to see how MIUI 11 performs on the POCO F1. So also the Xiaomi's, uh, I mean the POCO series spokesperson confirmed that MIUI 11 is going to come soon in India. So followed by the global beta rollout of MIUI 11. So that means we can expect to see the MIUI 11 beta, maybe the global beta in the mid October, maybe October 15th before. So I'm going to keep updating you guys about this ROM. So anyway, as of now, so as you can see, uh, this is the MIUI 11. I have installed it and you can see that it's a GSI by the way guys and it's sort of like super buggy and you cannot use it as a daily driver but if you want to try it you can do it just want to taste the initial look of the MIUI 11 you can go ahead and do it and if you want to install this GSI so just can you go ahead and follow the instructions in the description down below so anyway as you can see I have installed this uh, POCO launcher because the default launcher is not good it's super buggy and some of the applications like Google services like the YouTube, Google Pay, doesn't even work at all. So as you can see, YouTube is actually keep loading. It's not loading the content. And the my Wi-Fi is 50 Mbps. It's not loading the content. And also the camera, I tried to manage installing the Google camera. It's not working. You can see the force close messages. And the only thing it's working is the Google Chrome is actually working pretty good. And I didn't try any kind of a games from the Play Store because this is a Chinese ROM, right? This is not the global ROM. This is a Chinese ROM. That means you will not gonna be get any Google services. You have to sideload the Google Play services as well as the Play Store when you install this. Then only you will be able to access the application from the Google Play Store. So, which is actually pretty annoying. And also the MIUI 11, you can see the dark mode, all the things actually working fine. You can go ahead and enable the dark mode. You can see it's actually working pretty fine. It looks fantastic. So as you can see, it looks fantastic in the dark mode. And I'm going to go ahead and turn it off. And also you can see the MIUI 11 also comes with the screen time. And uh, everything is actually working. A little bit of features are broken. Uh, sometimes I have noticed that the Bluetooth is also having an issues. And the flashlight, you can see it's completely broken. It's not even working. It's expected because the GSI you're not gonna expect to uh, make all the features work on this device because that actually made for another device and fortunately we are running the GSI uh, MIUI 11 on our POCO F1. So as you can see guys, this is the uh, first initial look of the MIUI 11. So if you wanna know more about the MIUI 11, I made a dedicated video about uh, top features of MIUI 11. So just gonna go ahead and watch the video by clicking on the card here and you're gonna come to know everything about the MIUI 11. So I'm not gonna be explaining everything about what's new in MIUI 11 again and again. So just gonna go ahead and watch that video. And talking about this uh, GSI, uh, the final verdict so don't install this it's not super good and it's super buggy so phone calls are working as you can call to somebody else the phone calls are working the message is also working but it won't come with the camera 
and like normal basic functionalities are sort of broken and uh, I didn't uh, test the fingerprint let's try this I didn't even test the fingerprint I forgot that thing so let's gonna go ahead and say fingerprint unlock I'm gonna go to the pin okay so you can see that beautiful font actually across the whole system so actually looks fantastic so I'm gonna go ahead and just gonna go ahead and turn the pin and see if it works oh it's actually working guys the fingerprint sensor is actually working pretty fine so as you can see it's done let's try to unlock it okay so as fingerprint is actually working fine so there we go now uh, as I told you the face unlock I didn't try it so it may gonna work may not gonna work but the battery performance is actually good so you can see it's actually pretty good the MIUI 11 comes with the ultra power saving mode so which is a pretty good feature and overall I would say um, this is not the recommended GSI that you can go ahead and flash it because you may run into a lot of trouble so just gonna go ahead and stay on the ROM which you are so there's nothing big features in MIUI 11 so I'm just gonna go stay on the MIUI 10 so once the global beta rolls out so just gonna go ahead and update it without using the TWRP recovery so as of now this is sort of complicated process and if you want to do it so just gonna go ahead and follow the instructions done below so that's it guys this is the first initial look of me 11 running on the poco f event so i'm gonna surely gonna confirm you when will the new update comes out so in the youtube community page as well as i'm gonna keep posting the videos on poco f event about the latest features of me 11 as well as the latest updates on custom rom so for that you can just go ahead and subscribe to this channel and consider clicking on the bell button to get notified and if you want to know what's new in MIUI 11 again just gonna go ahead check the link in the description watch that video and you're gonna come to know everything so thanks for watching this video i hope you liked it so subscribe peace